Assalamu alaikum, dear learners. I am Muhammad Dejal Gurim, assistant teacher of English, Devot Hills High School, Mohit Pradwar, Dhaka. Today I am here to give you an online class as before. In my previous classes, I, have, I discussed many topics of English grammar. In like manner, I would like to discuss today completing sentence. It is a very important topic of English grammar. Without learning this topic, no none can capture this language perfectly. For this reason, it is very important for you. This class is mainly important for the students of 9th class and 10th classes. The students of the 8th class may also get benefit from this class. So I hope that all the students of these classes will observe my class very carefully. And I hope that you will be benefited from this class. And if you are benefited from this class, my class will be successful, otherwise not. You know, this topic is very important. Usually, the students are given five or seven sentences and each sentence carry one mark. So, if you want to earn these marks, five or seven marks, you have to learn all the rules of this chapter. But you know that our time is limited. On the other hand, there are many, many rules of this topic. For this reason, it will be not possible for us to run to discuss all the rules of this topic. For this reason, I would like to discuss some basic, very, very basic rules of this chapter. The first rules that comes to us is in spite of. It is a very important device for completing sentence. This device is usually used to show the difference between the natural ability of the subject and the action of the subject. It is used to present two different ideas in a sentence. Dear learners, I would like to clarify your idea by giving an example. Look at this sentence. He attended the meeting in spite of. This sentence is incomplete. You have to complete this sentence. And in case of completing this sentence, you have to be very careful about the meaning of the sentence and about the structure of the sentence. If we add here his illness, our sentence will be complete. We can complete this sentence with a noun or noun phrase or gerund or gerund phrase. This time our sentence has been complete. Look at this sentence. He attended the meeting in spite of his illness. This means that this subject has illness, yet he has attended the meeting. We know that usually a sick person or ill and an ill person can't attend the meeting, yet he has done it. Let's see the second rule. Our second rule is because of. Because of is a very important device for completing an incomplete sentence. It comes in our daily affairs very frequently. For this reason, it is very necessary for the learners to capture the rule of this because of. Usually, this device is used to introduce a reason for doing an action. This device is used to say that the subject has done or has not done a particular thing for a particular reason. I would like to clarify your idea by giving an example. Look at this sentence, dear learners. She arrived late because of dot 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 dot. This sentence is incomplete. We have to use here some word, a word or some words that will correspond with this sentence. If we write here rain, our sentence will be complete. She arrived, here, she arrived late because of rain. I hope that you have understood this sentence. 
और थर्ड रोल इज उदाउट उदाउट प्लस नाउन और उदाउट प्लस जीरांड और जीरांड फ्रेस दिस रोल इज वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग फॉर द स्टूडेंट्स एंड दे यूज दिस रूल वेरी फ्रिक्वेंटली वी यूज दिस रूल वेरी फ्रिक्वेंटली इन इन आवर लैंग्वेज इट वी यूज दिस रूल वेरी ऑफन वाइल कॉन्वर्सेशन फॉर दिस रीजन वी शुड बी वेरी केयरफुल अबाउट द यूज ऑफ दिस विदाउट यू कैंट पास द एग्जाम विदाउट वी हैव टू बी केयरफुल अबाउट completing this sentence this sentence this incomplete sentence want wants a noun or noun phrase or gerund or gerund phrase if we write here without studying properly You can't pass the exam without studying properly. Our sentence is correct now. Look at this sentence. You can't pass the exam without studying properly. So this device has been used here to mention a precondition. A study is the precondition for passing the exam. This this device explain it. i i i hope that you have understood this rule and our next option is so that so that is a very important device for completing an incomplete sentence this device comes in our conversation very frequently for this reason we should be careful about using this device so that is usually used to introduce a an intention of the subject the subject will da, will do or will not do a particular thing for performing his intention look at this sentence he bought a dictionary so that here the subject has bought a dictionary for for a particular reason and his intention is learning words look at this sentence dear learners he bought a dictionary so that he could learn words here after the the part which has been used after so that introduce introduces an intention of this subject for this intention under this intention he has bought a dictionary he has purchased a dictionary so that he can learn so that he could learn words for learning words in a word for learning words he has bought this dictionary so you can use this you can exercise many more sentences for learning this device the use of of these devices and you can learn more and you can enhance your language ability i hope that you have understood this class and you have understood these rules very carefully properly if you don't understand this rule properly you can contact with me over phone i will try my best to solve your problem uh before departing from this class i would like to remind you a thing that this time is very critical time because of corona pandemic you should be very careful about this disease and you should use mask on the face before going out and after going from the outside environment you must wash your hands very carefully Thank you very much for watching this class